you never follow that song here. Let me see. No, it's not. It's just me.
had to go put on the YouTube wig. <laughs> What's up, y'all? Hey, PMC, Frugal Mama, Super Food Parents, Young Riaz, Bud Files, and Super Rainbow Queen. I'm gonna cook these with some ground beef and some ragu and a whole bunch of cheese and stuff, you know? I got my water boiling and I'm finna cook the meat. I asked her to get the meat out, but I don't know about you what I asked them to do. How's everyone doing today? Are you gonna get your plate ready? This sink overrun. I just got done watching that little cartoon that you made. Super food parent. That's good quality content. That's good. Yeah. But I've been wanting to eat some home cooked food. I'm tired of eating fast food. I was so hungry last night. I was about to eat peanut butter and jelly sandwich last night. No. Well, I know y'all know what I mean. The fast food don't do nothing for you. I don't know what y'all been doing. I've been chilling. I'm just going live today. There's nothing really special I'm finna talk about today. I don't got really nothing special to talk about today. What's up, Anne Marie? Y'all know I, I haven't been cooking. I just been eating fast food. Yesterday I was working on my car and everybody was like, I'm so sorry um, that you're going through this, but I don't know. I'm not going through nothing, y'all. That's life. And these cars. I'm okay. I'm okay. Hey, Joshua. I'm okay, y'all, but thank you. It is. But... I still got to go check the AC in my car. It's not cold. I'm just cooking some ground beef, y'all. That's all I'm doing. This is garlic powder. It's kind of hard, though. I got some minced garlic, but I'm being like... Okay. And Maria, I got my trophies because I was driving my car. And, um, well, I fixed my truck. Not that I got my car fixed. I didn't get anything fixed. I fixed it. Okay? Let's make that clear. But, um, <laughs> I'm just saying for anybody that didn't understand. But, like, listen, when I parked the truck, it was the AC was working. But the cars had this funky smell, like, rotten egg and it was the battery but now the ac not working in the truck or the car so it don't matter which car i drive i don't have no ac in either car right now that's why i'm at the crib tuba check 
I ain't going nowhere to the chat. It's too hot. I ain't got no AC in the car. And we at the red light and everybody be looking at you. Everybody looking at me at the red light. I need some more seasoning. Y'all know me. I always need some more seasoning. They done tore my cabinet up, though. Thanks for coming through to the chat. They done told. I think they be... My daughter said they be playing in my seasoning. See, ain't nothing in the trays where they supposed to be. I think when I'm not here, they just take the seasonings and mix everything together. Because I swear, nothing is where it should be. I'm going to use some of this. I'm going to use some of this Goya. I'm going to use some of this Goya. We don't measure anything. If you ever watch me cook, you never see me measure anything because I'm not. I don't measure anything. I just sprinkle, 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 and then I sniff, and then I just sprinkle some more. I use my nose, and it all turns out good. I got some of this adobe. I got this other adobe too. I can use that one. I don't have any seasoning, so which makes no sense. That's how I know they're playing in my stuff. Because I should have some seasoning, so. But I've been wanting this pasta. So let's do this. Thanks for being here, guys. I appreciate you. Yes. I hope everyone is enjoying their summer. When it get done, I'll be putting like oregano on there with parmesan, probably some mozzarella. I got me some um garlic cheese bread. Well, I got a loaf of garlic bread and I'm going to put some cheese on top, you know? Yes. I haven't uploaded any videos because I'm still having an issue with that. So, that's why I've been creating shorts and going live. So, as soon as I can get my videos uploaded, I'll upload them. I appreciate you guys for putting up with me. I've been wanting some stuff shares. Yes. And it's like, I was looking at recipes, but it's like, I don't even know why I look at recipes. Because once I start cooking, I'm going to do what I want. Oh, I forgot. Hold up. I got my onion right here. I got to cut my onion up. I'm tripping. Love, love. Nothing. I'm talking to my subscribers. I didn't even tell them about you. Y'all want to see my other daughter? She's here. There she go. Look, y'all. They gonna go crazy now. <laughs> That's lovely, y'all. That I be talking about. Yes. That's my TikTok cutie. Mm-hmm. All right, bye. Can't stay in the camera too long. Get back, get back, get back. <laughs> That's all y'all get. It's a little simple. I'm cooking some pasta, some large shells um, pasta. It's kind of like my muscacholi. She asking me what I'm cooking. It's kind of like muscacholi. But, um. Hey, what's up, Jazz? Hey, Team Deep Water. Popcorn. I had took some of the hamburger out the pack to cook something else this morning. I shouldn't have did that. I needed all that hamburger. I don't know what I was thinking. I need all that hamburger. My bad for chopping this up in y'all ear, but this is how I do it. I know some people like to crumble their meat up and season it before they put it in there, but no, not me. I just throw it in the skillet, season it, and now I'm finna add some onions and green peppers. And then that's why I'm always rushing, because I don't be cutting my food up ahead of time. So this is just a sweet onion. This is what I'm putting in here. Sweet onion. 
And I got three green peppers in the fridge. I'm going to grab this. But I might have to use my frozen peppers that's already cut up because I waited too long. It do make a difference, like, if you, um, using frozen or fresh. I really do prefer the fresh veggies, you know? I really do. Yes, Jess is my member. That's my girl right there. That's my girl, Anne-Marie. What y'all doing? Where's Chef at? I was looking for him in the chat. Let me grab my green peppers. I usually cut my um peppers and onions up and saute them in butter, but I'm being lazy. What are you guys eating today? Anne Marie, that was nice of you to do that. What are you, Anne Marie? Are you cooking today? What time are you gonna cook? What are you guys eating today? Because I refuse to eat fast food today. I refuse to let a 16 year old cook my, my dinner. I refuse to let a 16 year old fry my chicken tonight. Straight up. You know what I'm talking about. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about. Like, how hard is it? I couldn't cook when I was 16 either, though. But at least I knew how to cook some, some uh, burgers and some fries. They don't even know how to do that. real girl what juice you talking about I'm going to get Korean corn dogs with my friend what's a Korean corn dog I don't know what's the what's the what makes it what's the difference in the regular corn dog and the Korean corn dog hey Tamika what's the difference in I never heard of a Korean corn dog what's the difference I'm cutting up these vegetables. I can't see what I'm doing because I got this iPad I'm sitting on top of my salad. I had a salad. Yes, my day is going good because I refuse to let anybody ruin my day. I refuse to let anybody piss me off. And in this new job that I got, all they do is talk to you and teach you how to talk to people when they talk to you crazy. So if anybody thinks they're going to talk to me crazy and get a reaction, it's going to be hard. It's going to be hard to piss me off. Yeah. Yeah, I made a video last night on my shorts. And I uploaded a short last night. And I said... Am I a bad mother for feeding my kids too much fast food? Why? Because I'm enticing the people who want to react. You want to react? Okay. They're like, yes, you're a bad mom. Thank you for the comments. Thank you. 
Because you know if you say, oh, am I a bad mom for feeding? Or, if I'm a bad mom, you can say anything. Am I a bad mom for giving my kids too much money? Am I a bad mom for making sure my kids wear sunscreen? Am I a bad mom for always being with my kids? If I say the words, am I a bad mom? Of course, somebody's going to comment and say, yes, you're a bad mom. Because people just stupid like that. So, yeah, that's why I said what I said. And then I made a typo. So then somebody was like, hmm, did you have an aneurysm trying to type that? Uh, did you have an aneurysm trying to read it? Because I did that on purpose. <laughs> Thanks for the comment. So, yeah, you, you two, there's the good, there's the bad, and then there's the truth. So yeah, I'm tired of eating fast food and I fed my kids a lot of fast food. And somebody was like, yeah. But when I took my YouTube class or whatever, the girl told me to spell stuff wrong in my title on purpose when I'm typing. Because it's people out there that's going to say something because they can't help it but to worry about what somebody else is doing just bothers you so much that I spelled that wrong. Huh? You just couldn't just ignore it, huh? You got the proofread my stuff, huh? Mind you, I took comp one and comp two. If you don't know what that is, that's my English college classes. I've written my fair share of papers, okay? I paid, well, I only paid $83 a credit hour, but hey, I paid to be able to type wrong when I want to spell something wrong. Let me see. Okay, I got my bell peppers in here. Let me see what kind of sauce I want to use. What you doing, Miss Tracy? I was thinking about you when I was getting hot the other day. I was like, ooh, this is what Miss Tracy be talking about. When she said it was 102 degrees at 10 o'clock. I'm going to do typos and bad mom videos because haters love to hate. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. I made a typo. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. But I got, I got, um, I don't think I want to mix them. I got the sauteed garlic onion. Chunky. They both chunky. This one also says chunky. And this one is the parmesan. What is Romano? Is that a type of cheese? Romano. What's the Romano part? Please tell me. And then I got the, I think I'm gonna mix them. My water starting to boil. Took forever. Took forever. How you doing, Mother of Twins? Hi, Daily Design. How are you? What's up with you? Got my Dollar Tree cup. I forgot where I got this straw from. <sighs> yep, I just been minding my business, working in my new job. Taking advantage of all the benefits that this job has to offer. Trying to talk myself into not quitting every day. I'm telling you, I would rather be at the crib. Who want to be broke though? So, got to go to work. <laughs> For real. Is there anything that I wanted to tell you? I don't know. You guys let me know. You laughing at me, Jazz? What you laughing at? Do I like the new job? People stopped getting on my nerves when I ran out of... Girl, <laughs> I'm so behind in the chat. I be so behind. I like it, but then I don't like it because, like, every job that you get, it just depends. Okay. Every job is basically a new community. Just like we on here and all y'all is in the chat. Most of you guys know each other, right? This is a community. 
And every job is another community. So it's like everybody got their position in the job before you get there. So it's like, you know, depending on how old the management is and the people that, how long the, the leadership team has been there. You know what I mean? Still scoping that out. That's what I'm trying to say. This mug wasn't green enough for me. The other ones was, but I went on and cooked that one first. Miss your chat have I had someone stop me on the short because I titled it Bear in the Backyard instead of Bear in the Backyard. I exactly. What's up, Shay? Yes, you you got you gotta know what to do. Like Yes, so yes, sometimes you type the people be thinking you didn't did that on accident. No, I did that on purpose. But thank you for calling me out. Thanks for bringing that to my attention. I had to go to three stores to find large pasta shells. So I ended up finding these at Snooks. I had to go to three stores to find large pasta shells. I kept finding the ones that look like little macaroni noodles. It's not the same thing, okay? And these don't even look that big like the ones I usually get. Like, I wanted something bigger than this. We got James Guy Guy in the building. That's what's up. Yeah, I usually get them bigger than this. This not that big, see? So it's going to taste like muscacholi. Because they got some that be bigger than this. I threw that in the pot. But they got some that be bigger than this. But this is all I could find. Unless I wanted to get them um, cylinder looking ones. Them uh, What do you call this? Rot rotatini? I don't know. I didn't want those. James and Samantha sitting in the tree. K-I-N-S-I-N-G. Then comes Chef and Anne-Marie. African Madrine in April too. I'm just playing. <laughs> What's up, Key Kitchen? I want some chicken. I'm not draining this. I'm just gonna pour this um sauce right up in here. I ain't even show y'all the food. This my this is what I, it looks like. Okay, the green peppers still need to cook a little bit more, but they will cook. Cause I'm still gonna put it in the oven when I'm done. But I'm finna put this sauce up in here right now. Rochelle Venterpool. How you doing, darling? Don't play with her. I'd be like, it's so much stuff I could talk to y'all about. Then when I get on live, my mind go blank. Like, what was I going to talk to you about? What was I going to say? All I'm going to say is I'm trying to cook this food. And then last time I was talking to y'all, I was talking about that girl that had got kidnapped. But now I'm not sure. Did she really get kidnapped or was she faking? Hmm? I'm like, she, she had me all concerned. Had me praying for her. Let me find out she was faking. They better find her. They, she better, they better find her. The, the, the 911 call was like, what kind of car you were driving? She was like, a red Mercedes Benz. Let me find out you was lying in your little red Mercedes Benz. Please, let me find out. Oh, man. I, man, I felt so stupid because she had me concerned. I was concerned. I'm just mixing this sauce up, and I'm going to let it cook real slow while this pasta is cooking. I'm also going to add some sugar, because I like my sauce to be sweet. Yes, Jazz. I'm like, what? Yes, a pitiful hoax. Exactly. Tamika speaking to Miss Tracy. PMC said, I'm going to get on the road. I will be listening. Drive safely, PMC. Burning up all that expensive gas. Gas is expensive. He always going somewhere. He got some money. Straight up. 
I see you posting them model pics. Looking like a model. Why do you keep saying juice? Is juice and J up in here? What is that? What are you talking about? I'm in love with that strawberry lemonade from Aldi's. That's all this is. And then I added some lemonade to it. That's probably what they be giving you when you go to Applebee's. I swear I went to, um, where I was in. And they gave me some curly fries. Oh, I was at Jack in the Box and I had some curly fries. I'm like, I'm like, this is not Jack in the Box curly fries. Let me find out Jack in the Box got me some all these curly fries. I'm like, it's all these right next door. Did they run out of fries and go next door and give me some curly and go get curly fries? You know they'll do that in the hood. They'll go next door in a heartbeat if they run out of something and replace it in the hood. And be serving it to the customers. Like, no, I want what I paid for. If I wanted some all these fries, I would have went to all these. And got my fries from all these. Okay, so my daughter said that in Texas they don't cook muscatelli. I don't know how this looks to y'all, but I can't. Oh, I can't really move the screen. Okay. I got somebody staring at me. Can I help you? Can I help you? Yes, um, oh, got me some garlic bread. Some garlic bread. I'm going to turn this oven on. I don't know why I always check the label every time I cook. I'll be like, how much? This one says $4.25. It on um, did she tell me the difference between okay? I guess I'm gonna have the, the difference between a Korean hard dog nails by Carrie. What up, though? Six bows, I feel you, right? Rias, thank you, James. Sometimes I'm lazy when I'm typing, I don't want to correct myself. Man, my keyboard is too small. Thank you, Anne Marie. Yes. I'm just so glad to be off work today. What you gonna go get eat, Miss Tracy? I know you're gonna get something good. Miss Tracy don't play by her food, y'all. Nails by Carrie. Girl, I need my nails done. My nails look good right now, but I don't like the lady they did them. I don't I don't care how good she do nails. I don't like her attitude. I need somebody. It fits both. You got to have good attitude and be good at what you do. I don't care how good you are at what you do. Your attitude suck. And she hit my cuticle too many times the next day. Not even the next day, but when I got in the shower for the next two days. And anytime I washed my hands for the next two days, my cuticles was on fire. Why do I be having the horrible nail experiences? Well, we got gorgeous one link. Gorgeous one, me. Hey, gorgeous one, me. Oh, yeah. Gorgeous one, me just cooked some pasta the other day, y'all. Y'all, and it's a really good video. If you want to really know how to cook this pasta, go check out Gorgeous One Mink. And she's really doing good on TikTok. So go over there and make sure you check out her TikToks. That's my girl. She is really good, and she will follow you and support you back. So, if you want a good, good, genuine person, channel to watch, no messiness, she's your girl. Gorgeous one, me. I keep saying that because that's how a TSM rapper wrote her song. Gorgeous one, me. Here y'all go. My sauce is done, okay? I'm still going to be adding stuff to it. I got some oregano leaves. I just put all the pasta in here. And um, 
Yes, Jazz, you know gorgeous with me. Yes. Y'all gotta go check her out over on TikTok. Y'all know how hard it is to grow on these platforms. Sometimes you grow on TikTok. Sometimes you grow on IG. Oh, shoot. I almost dropped the spoon in there. Thank you, PMC. He said, looks great. You don't know, Miss Tracy? Okay, all right. I'll be looking for the video. Yes. So now I'm just going to turn this down and put the sauce on low into this pasta start cooking <sighs> I got me some um I don't know why I wanted these so bad last night I woke up and went and bought them this morning I'm gonna eat these later after I finish my meal I had to have these today mm -hmm. I'm gonna try these moves Ooh. <laughs> Yes, she is, Jess. She watches and leaves a genuine comment. You can tell that she watched from the beginning till the end. Yes. I can't wait till this food get done. Let me get my um, pan ready to put this uh, garlic bread in the oven. Bro, I was at Sam's yesterday, and they already got Halloween. It's Halloween. Happy Halloween. It's already Halloween, y'all. It's back to school already, and it's already Halloween. Somebody tried to tell me it wasn't Christmas yet, and we was having a whole arguing about it yesterday. I'm like, it is Christmas. They're like, it ain't Christmas yet. I'm like, it is Christmas. It's Christmas in July. What you mean? It's Christmas. See, this, this makes me mad. Spectrum just sent me a message and says, um... Okay, don't be interrupting my service for for, for preventative ma preventative maintenance. They make sure they, they don't interrupt your service long enough to have to offer you any type of credit adjustment, don't they? They make sure that. Why did I give Keep my Christmas lights up and plugged up all year around. That's what's up. Your favorite is Christmas. Yeah, it's just, you know, I got kids. So there's no avoiding. I'm using the piece of pen. There's no avoiding these holidays when you have small children. This mug long. It'd be hard to get that garlic smell off your fingers once you get that garlic on you. Yeah, I can't see what I'm doing. I am not gonna put the cheese on there yet. I have the cookie for a little bit first before I put the cheese on me. Cause you don't want your cheese to burn. You know, you don't want your cheese to burn. I'm still waiting on this pasta to start boiling. It's taking forever. I'm impatient. That's why. I, <laughs> that's why I'll be cooking because I'll be like, I want to eat right now. Then I'll be regretting it because they don't cook nothing right. Do your kids use your salted butter? If you got kids, you know what I'm talking about. I know all of y'all don't got kids, but my kids be using my salted butter. I'd be like, why you didn't use that Imperial or that Blue Bonnet 
Why did you use my salted butter? You listening in the car? Oh, I love how we understand these YouTube emojis. What food is that? Hey, Amber, this is, uh, let me move this pan. Yeah, make sure it's not hot. Okay. Amber, these are large pasta shells. Here they go. Okay. Time to put this in the oven. Whew. When you open the oven, ladies, ladies, and gentlemen, too, don't let that heat hit you in your face. It's not good for your skin, okay? When you open that oven and that heat hits you in the face, it's not good for your skin at all. It's basically like going outside and doing like this. I swear, because when I used to get my um chemical pills, I couldn't even open the oven. Swear. Like, I couldn't even stand over this gas stove after I got my chemical pill. You could feel the heat on your face. So, when you open the oven, ladies, hold your face back. Don't let that heat hit you in your face. Okay? It's not good. Not good. Not good. Who was I talking to yesterday about cold water? And they was like, oh, cold showers. And, oh, I was talking to Lance Pride about cold water. Yeah. And she was talking about how good it is to drink and to shower in cold water. Yes, real butter is the best, Miss Tracy. Butter and cheese is my thing. Miss Tracy, butter and cheese is my thing. Give me some real butter, some real cheese, some real chocolate, some real lemonade. Woo! All of that. Yeah, so like what I was telling them over there when I was talking yesterday was like a cold shower. So okay, you can you don't have to take a complete cold shower. She's like gets you all the time that oven heat. Yes, yeah, smacks you all up in the face, Miss Tracy. So when you okay, you can after you wash up, your pores is wide open. After you shampoo, cleanse your face, your pores is wide open. And then the cold water tightens the pores. That's why you're like, oh, that's your pores tightening up. So that keeps the bacteria from coming inside the pores. And then like when you're getting your hair done, it smooths your follicles. So like if you just shampooed and conditioned and then you wash your hair in some really hot water, it's not going to be as silky as your hair would have been if you would have used cold water to rinse their conditioner out so when you rinse you can rinse out that shampoo and some warm water but when you rinse out the conditioner rinse the conditioner out in some cool water girl yes this is never from never from concentrate i'm just playing so this that all these lemonade it's only 11 percent juice but it be going on sale for a dollar 79 i think i paid two something for it yesterday i'll be buying these and then i just keep refilling my cup my little Dollar Tree cup. And it says, all my favorite people call me mom. All my favorite people call me mother. Yes, they got strawberry. And I think that's what I meant to get. I did not mean to get raspberry. I meant to get strawberry. They both good. But the strawberry tastes better. Yep. It's good. <laughs> uh, my bread in there cooking. 
Where my cheese at? So I got some mozzarella. This is that organic Simply Nature mozzarella. And the crazy thing about this cheese is I got it from Aldi's. You don't like raspberries? It don't taste like raspberry. But the strawberry do taste better. Raspberries are all hairy looking. I can't eat hair. I can't eat nothing with all that hair on it. What is that? Huh? What is all that stuff on the raspberry? Why the raspberry so hairy? But anyway, this organic Simply Nature cheese at all these. It the organic is cheaper than the regular. So that's why I got the organic. Because I always get what's up on sale. I'm finna put all of this in here. That was my plum and shine. Because that's all I had left. And I need to use that up. So. I always do that. And I gotta get some sugar. I need some sugar. Thank you. Oh, excuse me. I keep burping. All right. So, I got my Parmesan on there. And I always got to put a whole bunch of sugar on there, too. Yeah. So, my phone's ringing. Hello. I'm cooking and I'm live streaming. I bet my phone had room. It threw me off for a second. I'm kind. Yeah, I be scared because I love sugar too. And I be like, man, I be having to be careful. How much sugar I put in here. Because I love sugar too. It's time to drain my noodles. I'm gonna drain my pasta. Yeah, the organic cheese. <laughs> organic. The organic cheese do be um. It be it was it be cheaper. Like I don't know. It's um that's how you like how you know it's really organic. Cause I can't tell if it's cheaper. Why is it cheaper? Hey, Brett. What's up with you? I'm gonna put that on the bread, that that organic cheese, on top of that garlic bread. Happy Saturday, little bit. What's up? Let me make sure this pasta is tender first before I take it out. Yes, yeah, good. I be watching somebody cook on YouTube, and when I tell you she is the goat, she is the goat, the lady. The lady is such a professional. This is someone with over a million subscribers. And when I tell you, the lady is so good at what she does. I'll be like, man, she's so good. No wonder the sponsors watch her. Be taking notes, boy. Taking notes. Sugar cuts the acid in the sauce not to be sweet. 
Okay, Miss Tracy, schooling me. Thank you, Amber. Yes, tell your cousins to subscribe. All of y'all got a cousin that'll like me. Because I'm the cousin. Tell your cousins. What? Somebody got a... It's, Look like a piece of eggshell or something. Tell your cut. This is not enough pasta. Okay, you guys, come back over here. Come over here. Come over here. Let's put this in here. Let me show you. Let me show you. to make a short real fast but i ain't gonna... yes tell your cousins okay here we go do you see these little white things that's that real parmesan cheese okay and then it's started it's started to make that slow down i'm just gonna do this okay i'm gonna turn it off I'm turning it off. What I'm going to do is cook this in my corning ware. If you don't know what corning ware is, you'll have to stick around for a few more minutes and I'll get it out and we're going to put it in another dish. I'm going to, oh, hold up, hold up. Let's, let's check on the bread. Okay, hold up. It's time to put the cheese on there. Oh, y'all will see y'all every time y'all cook with me, y'all don't be helping me. Y'all be like, oh, I'm gonna let her burn the bread up. Let's see if she burned the bread up this time. Y'all don't let me burn my bread up before. You was gonna let me burn my bread up again. Okay, let's add some more sauce. Cause don't nobody want no dry pasta. It's hard to stir with this phone in your hand, you know? You would think I would have all my cameras set up by now. I have been on YouTube for like four years. All of my cameras and ring lights are in a tote somewhere in a box. But listen, this is large pasta shells, green onions, uh, no, green peppers, sweet onion, sauteed onion ragu Parm what's that what's the other ragu parmesan and romano ragu some um black pepper minced onion some garlic powder some pink salt the himalayan pink salt i grind the grinder then we added that adoba you know the goya seasoning and we didn't measure anything remember we did not measure this is stirred up good enough you got to stir it up to make sure the pasta go inside the shell like that you want to get that pasta all the way up in there flat out okay so that's what i'm doing i'm trying to make sure that that all oh, that meat get up in there in there so that's how I do that. I'm kind. And then I still got some more pasta right here that I'm going to add. My corning layer is on the bottom. See? Corning. They sell this at Macy's. This is the old style but as the years change they just put different styles on the front so i'm gonna put this pasta in here gotta rinse it out first i also have a small one that i use if i want to use the flat one i have a flat one like this i don't use pyrex because pyrex explodes so i don't use pyrex I'll save you guys some. You better get here fast though. Diddy. 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 Diddy.
What up, though? She say, how about I thought you were going to stuff the Lord's shelves? Didi, they too small. I couldn't find the big ones. It says large shelves, but I guess we need jumbo. Like, I went to three stores, and these were the biggest ones I could find. Now, last time I made these, they were huge. Yeah. Tell me where they are so I can go get me something. All right, so I'm trying to debate. Do I want to use this one or this one? This one? I think I want to use both of them and just separate it. I think I want to use both of them. Olive Garden. Oh, yeah. Um, I still got a sticker on here. Um, I went to Olive Garden the other day. I had the chicken and shrimp carbonara. But I got the, I don't get the bacon. I do not like the bacon. So I had them take the bacon out and add broccoli. Fire. Fire. However, my total was $26. And I was like, dang. I can't be eating this every time. Straight up. Total was $26. Then used to cost $16.98. I used to know my total. When I, before um, I got to the register. Now, I don't ever know. You don't know what the hell your total going to be till they tell you. You got to be like, damn, I must really want this. Be like, I must really want this. Okay, y'all. I don't have no way of showing you this. How you doing today, Dee Dee? OMG, what y'all talking about? Oh, bigger, not always better. She's so silly. I gotta put this in here. Baby girl, what's your name? Talk to you, buy you a drink. I'm T Pay. You know me. I don't know why that song in my head. Please don't ask me. Please don't ask me. I'm putting this cheese on here. Yeah, I'm finna put that in the oven whenever I put this. Um, I, don't, I thought I had flipped the camera around. My bad. <laughs> my bad, y'all. I thought I had flipped the camera, but um. When I put this in the oven, I'm going to put this in the oven with it. I'm going to put some cheese. I'm going to put some more cheese up in there. I'm going to put this in the other pot. You know what I'm saying? I got to put some more cheese on her too. You know, that's what we doing. Don't act like me. I don't know why everybody be trying to be perfect like they like they cook perfect. No, I, this how we cook. Oh, this is how we be cooking. Everybody be trying to act like, oh, they got their food all chopped up. They got everything all ready. They all neat. They stove be sparkly. Get the... Okay, sure. Mm -hmm. Excuse me, but when I go to work, my kids be at home sometimes. And they be in here making a mess on my stove. Okay. Be real with yourself. Be real with it. Stop faking. Let's get some more cheese, okay? Oh, here it go. I know I had some more parmesan. I'll just put that on when I take it out on my, on my, on my personal, for my personal. <laughs> That's for me. <laughs> Straight up. Okay. So I'm gonna put this back in the oven. My garlic bread. It's almost done. I wanna bite it. I'm hungry, so. Mm. Okay. That's the perks of cooking at home and not eating fast food. You can eat while you cooking. Hey. 
I got boys. Okay, what I'm gonna do? Put some more cheese on here. And then I'm gonna put this in the oven just like this. After I stir it up and put some more cheese on it. That's all I be talking about is some more cheese this, some more cheese that. And I gotta mix this oregano in there too. That oregano look dark. Like, it don't look um, green, it looks brown. Time to get some fresh oregano. They be like, what is that? They see stuff, I sprinkle stuff like that in there. I'll be like, I always put that in there. Yeah, that's garlic bread. Mm-hmm. It's good too. And I'm burning up in front of this stove. I'm on I am so hot right now, y'all. So I'm finna put this in the oven. I'm not gonna cover it up. I'm just gonna put it in the oven just like this. We're gonna put it in there just like that. I could put more cheese on it if y'all want me to. We could put some more. If you want to, and just spread it. It's already cheese mixed in it, so you don't got to mix no more cheese in it. Okay. And I'm going to stick that in the oven. Right now. While I make my other one. I'm going to make another one. I got these noodles. Still has some more left. I didn't have no big old pan. That's why I did it like that. Because I don't have a big pan if y'all wondering why. Because usually I just go to Dollar Tree and get one of them big old pans. So I won't have to wash dishes. So, I don't have a big pan. This is what I use. So, it'll just be two pans instead of one, okay? I hope that's okay with you guys. Meow, meow. Meow. I don't want my bread to cook too long. I just want that cheese to melt because that bread is done. I don't want it to get too hard. I don't like when people make garlic bread and be like soggy in the middle. This is perfect. There's no reason to spend five, six dollars on garlic bread. Get the store brand. Get the store brand. Certain things, for example, pasta sauce, cookies, and a few other things, you need to get the good brand. Cheese. You need to get the good brand. You know, garlic bread, get the cheapest one. Just grab the cheapest one. Sometimes I see people and I be like, I ain't no way. I ain't no way I'm going to pay $8 for some garlic bread. I'll go home and make me some. For real. green stuff in here. I don't know what that was. It might have been that cheap palm olive. That green palm olive detergent. But I love my corn and bread, especially when it comes around um, what, palm olive? I call it, yeah, I don't like palm olive because I grew up on it. That's why I call it cheap. You know you grew up on something, you call it cheap. PMC, you still here? Okay, so I'm finna put this in here, PMC. Okay. Too bad, pow pow, in here. 
He always talks about my pasta. He always talks about my pasta. Okay, you want to see? That's what I just was doing. I put it in this other container. I'm going to put some cheese in here. See this one? I'm tempted to add more sauce because I am... I'm just like that. What do you guys think? Let me see. He was in your... I was, uh... Yeah, I was in your bushes this morning, PMC. I, I be in people bushes, man. For, for real, for real. Because I feel like this. If you know I don't like you and you know I don't mess with you, like if I see you in the chat, I'm not coming in the chat. But it be seeming like some people will see me and st like don't. I'm just gonna leave the chat. I swear I'm going in the bushes. If you come in the chat right behind me and you know that God ain't gonna well, I'm I don't even rock with you. That you negative energy. I just stay in the bushes. Stop. It feel like it almost feel like you're trolling me. If everywhere I go, you right behind me commenting, I'm like, hey everybody, hi everyone. Then here comes this troll. Hey everybody, hi everyone. Like, damn. I mean, just stay in the bushes, straight up. Like you just gonna follow me and just if I like real, I I don't even want to be in the conversation with you. Like, why you want? Like, why do I want to be around you? For real. Like, for real, for real. And I ain't even talking about your chat, PMC. It wasn't even in your chat. Like, it wasn't even in your chat this morning. It was everywhere else I went today. It was like, dang. Like, damn. Like, I don't even like you. Like, why are you following everywhere I go? Like, why do you want to avoid me? If you, if you, you said you was avoiding me. But it doesn't look like you're avoiding me. You said you was not rocking with me, but what everywhere I fucking go. So, you know, if you don't see six bows, she's just somewhere fucking minding her business. Unlike other people. I speak for me and the children. So if you got kids. That's why people don't be liking me. Because if you got kids and you do something I don't like, I'm going to say something about it. Calling out your parenting skills and you didn't like it, huh? Did I say the F word? Oh, my bad. Slip out of, slipped out on me. Slipped out on me. I, I do apologize. I do apologize. Here's the garlic bread. See, that's why I didn't want to put it back in there for too long. Because this one's starting to burn on the tip. But see, it's, you don't want to put... You don't got to put a lot of cheese on there. That's enough cheese right there. You don't need a lot of cheese. This one's even cheap. Oh! Hold up, y'all. It's stuck. Hold up, hold up. Oh! I don't know why I be like, oh! But, uh, I'm trying to get this garlic bread out of here. This one is stuck. But this one is even more cheesier. So this one's a little bit more cheesier. That's enough cheese, you know, because some people don't even put cheese on their garlic bread. And I don't think all my kids going to eat garlic bread anyway. I used to be in my chat. I used to be too in my chat. Hello, in the bushes. Oh, you like garlic bread? Yes. Tend to turn this up. Okay. On my Dollar Tree plate. I was washing dishes yesterday. And I was like, I don't like washing dishes. So I was like, I'm finna wash all my Dollar Tree stuff first. And I say, I'm gonna see how much stuff I got from Dollar Tree. So I was like, this came from Dollar Tree. This came from Dollar Tree. This came from Dollar Tree. Then I was like, 
This bowl came from Dollar Tree. This plate came from Dollar Tree. These plates came from Dollar Tree. I was like, I'm going to wash all the Dollar Tree stuff first. I had like three things left. <laughs> Ooh, I had like three things left when I got done washing dishes. Uh, I got done washing all the Dollar Tree stuff first. Wasn't barely nothing left. Because I used to buy expensive dishes. But they break my dishes. And then this dish. I like this. It's so cute. And for it to be in $1.25. I mean, I just keep going to Dollar Tree until my kids get old enough to stop breaking my stuff. Okay? So, shout out to Dollar Tree for always having a nice collection for each season. I, yeah, so they already got the fall collection out. This was the spring collection. They've already got the fall collection out. And this is what we're going to put a little... We're going to make a little plate on here. You know what I'm going to do. Make one little plate. Yes, be happy. Don't worry. Be happy. I was watching um one of my subscribers and she was like, just because. Be happy just because you woke up. Crystal clear. Shout out to the voice that matters. She was like, be happy. Just oh good. This looks so good. Let me show you. Mm. She was like, be happy. Just because. Because you woke up this morning. Look at that. That's why I love my corning wear. Because that corning wear, it do the do. Look at that. Okay, and then this one is the one I just put in there, and I put some Mexican cheese on it, so that's what it, that's why it looked like that. Cause that one's got a little blend of, um, like three or four different cheeses on it. But yeah, but look at that right there. Yeah, 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 yeah. So we don't want to cook it too long, cause you don't want your pasta to dry out. Happy, happy, happy. Yes, I'm happy because I'm almost done cooking. That's why I'm happy. I'm going to pour me some more lemonade for my meal. That's true, though. Be happy. Life's too short to be mad all the time. Or hate and hate drinks the individual who hateful. And it takes a lot of energy. Too much. Why y'all don't put stuff back where it go? Oh, I want to bake me a cake later so I can have me some cake tomorrow to take to work with me. I think I'm going to make me a pound cake. I'm going to take, take that one thing of pasta out right now. It don't take that long to cook this. This is an easy meal. I have to record this while it's still bubbling, you know? There we go, there we go. So, let's see. We go. I'm finna get me some of this right now. I'm finna get me some of this. Mom really got no big spoon, but that's what it looked like. If you was gonna eat with me, this is what we'd be eating. I got you, Jamie. Just fix my bed for me, okay? Come over to your house and cook. <laughs> I 
But anyway, I had to sit y'all down so I could dig into this, you know? For real. I've been wanting some lasagna, so this is closest I'm going to get. Because ain't nobody finna be taking their time with lasagna noodles and stuff. Woo! My finger touched the side of that container. I, I don't like getting burnt, man. I've been burnt before. I've been burnt before! Straight up. Okay, so that's that. Okay, where's my parmesan? I still have to put my other... Where's that? Man! Like, where's my other ingredients? Okay, here we go. I just bought this this morning. My three cheese Romano. I asked y'all what Romano was. Ain't nobody tell me though. I think if I had, I can cook for all of y'all. I know how to cook. I used to cook for weddings at a winery. We used to have three weddings at a time. I can cook for all y'all. Don't, don't try me. I'm for real. I'm saying. Food in the, in the kitchen. And we gonna. Don't try me. I'll do it. I sprinkled it in there. I meant to sprinkle it on my plate. I was talking stuff. Sprinkled it on the wrong thing. Yeah, y'all. I used to cook at a winery for weddings. So, you know what I'm saying? If my subscribers need me to cook. Yeah, yeah, need me to cook. You got to pay for the food. I'll cook it. You gonna rent me a big old Airbnb that all of y'all gonna fit in? I'll cook it. Straight up. I gotta check on the other one now. Yes, you know my swine cake. Oh, that's all I'm cooking. When I say I'm cooking a cake, it's always this cake. It's always my swine's cake. My one, two, three, four cake. One, two, three, four. This is done. That's done. This is mine. And that's for the children. You know how they be like, that's daddy food, don't touch it. Well, that's mama food, don't touch it. Ain't no icing on this cake, yeah? Ain't no icing going on no pound cake unless you want me to put some caramel glaze up on her. I'll make some caramel and put some caramel up on there. Ain't no icing. Ain't no icing going on no one, two, three, four cake. I really need to cook you this cake now because you didn't ask me this question and you didn't throw me all off with the icing. I got walkers. Y'all know I love the Walking Dead. And every time I cook, I start getting walkers. They start walking. They be like, is the food done? Is the food done, mama? I'm sorry. I love the Walking Dead. And I'm silly like that. Yes. Okay, yeah. One, two, three, four, something. Two sticks of butter. Two cups of sugar. Three cups of flour four eggs and one cup of milk that's why it's called a one two three four and then they got all these other recipes on there that's one two and three yeah so back in the day you ain't have all them ingredients you know what i'm saying you had to keep it simple one two three four you got to keep it simple and it be delicious long as you mix it up right because you got to mix it right you got to mix the eggs and the sugar over her you got to mix the flour and sift it over there. You can't just mix it all in one bowl and think it's going to turn out right. No. Good luck with that. Got my Dollar Tree silverware. I'm going to get the rest of this meat off of this spoon. Because I'm going to eat that.
That's all that cheese I put on there. Okay, now I can turn the oven off because, man, it done got hot. So, this is my plate. I'm done cooking. I, I was supposed to cook these, y'all, but I, I don't know why I didn't. I could have put them in the oven while I was talking. This was supposed to be the veggie. So, there's no veggie. Don't ask. You want some veggies? You better eat some lettuce. Okay? You gotta eat some salad. Remember, every family got that one unk at the cookout that be trying to get in everybody's plate. Right? Everybody, people, yes, and be trying to take a plate home. Oh, uh, you gonna buy a mess? She said, I will buy a massive, a massive, massive. You ready to eat? So I will buy a massive hotel. Don't play with me. Yeah, I will cook for y'all. I will. I, I don't know why I put that spoon over here. I need that spoon. Mm -hmm. Now I gotta get another one. This Holly plate is standing right here next to me. Holly G. I call her Holly G because her middle name is Giovanna. I named her Giovanna because I wanted a boy so bad. And it was a girl. You supposed to have been a boy. <laughs> so, I named her Giovanna because her name was supposed to be Giovanni. Holly G. That's my bodyguard. Don't play. It's my shadow. My other pair of eyes. You be thinking. They be like, Mama, you ain't see that? How you ain't see that? I be like, what? What? What I, what I didn't see? They got my back. There you go. Thank you. That's why they get to eat for free. That's why they get to eat for free. They got my back. They be like, Mama, how you didn't see that? I be like, see what? Because I was driving. I can't swim, cook, or ride. What? I can't swim. I can cook, and I can ride a bike. But I prefer I prefer my next bike to be electric. I want an electric bike. I'm not trying to pedal. I'm trying to ride the bike to the riverfront. And I know the way back is all uphill. I'm not trying to pedal back. I can't sit y'all over here. I'm not trying to pedal back to back and forth from the riverfront. What you need from over here? Uh, a I thought she was finna say some sugar. <laughs> I just knew it. I just knew it. I thought she was gonna be like, can I get some sugar? Get the fork out that drawer right there. I just knew she was gonna be like, can I get some sugar? I ain't not sugar. I'm gonna be like, I did put sugar. Somebody, somebody's gonna say. That I didn't put sugar on here. And you guys saw me add the sugar. sugar right. You know what I wish I had to go with this though? I want some catfish filet. Okay, somebody else can have this plate. Here you go. You want this one? There you go. You want this one? Okay. I'm the dishwasher. I'm the cook. I am the housekeeper. I am the teacher. I'm the nurse. I'm the dentist. I pull teeth. I pull teeth. I'm the tooth fairy. I bring the money when the tooth comes. I am Santa Claus. Because I bring the presents. I bring the presents. I am Cupid. Because I bring all the Valentines. I am the Easter Bunny. 
Y'all think I'm playing. I am all of the in the ab I am all of the above. I am woman. That's what I am. I am woman. I am powerful. I am beautiful. Uh, I cannot wait to eat this food. I'm going to eat my salad with it. I know my salad probably not cold no more, but I'm still going to eat it. She don't get nothing for free because she been being bad. This was getting charged. When that cash app come through, then you could eat. Hey, y'all. Straight up. I'm cutting this bread up for them. In case somebody else want to come back and get another piece of bread. I feel like this loaf tastes better than the sliced ones that come with the cheese already on there. I watched the thing on how they do the frozen food. And some of the processes, you know, they use liquid nitrogen. Some of the processes to freeze the food take like a couple hours. And then some of the processes to freeze food take a couple days. So... That's why some frozen food tastes better than others. Hashtag pay, pay DET. <laughs> What's DET? Pay that? Pay that? And Pepsi would go well. I know. I got one little. That's all I got left, PMC. That's yeah, all I got left, and it's hot. That's all I got left. I'm finna um sit down and eat my food though. I got my plate, her plate, she got a plate. It's a plate over there. I gotta fix another plate. Never ending job. Got one more plate to fix. Gotta fix another plate. Then I'll go in my room and then I'm going to eat. Then when I come back, that's, there will be no leftovers. There will be no leftovers. I love the chunky sauce. Thank you, PMC. I'm enjoy. I am, I am going to enjoy my meal. All of it. That's why I love the chunky sauce. Because when you get the chunky, it has these big tomatoes in it like that. You see? That's what they mean by chunky sauce. Means they're going to give you the big veggies. And that's why I like the chunky. Yeah, thanks for being here, guys, and hanging out with me while I cook. It always makes it so much easier because sometimes cooking can be stressful for me because I'm the only one cooking. Nobody's helping me. So, thanks for your help. Oh, he said compliments to the chef. Thank you. I wish that I could read all my comments like PMC, but I can't keep up. I burned my kitchen down if I could read the comments like him. So, me and my girls are going to go eat our food. Make sure that you like this video. And when the video ends, please leave a comment on the video. All right? Leave a comment on it for me. Okay? And I'll see you guys soon. When I say soon, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know if that's like later on today i don't know if that's tonight or tomorrow tomorrow's sunday so if i don't see you before monday you'll always see me on money making monetizing motivating monday you guys so make sure that you're getting ready for next week right now don't wait till the last minute okay guys pmc thank you so much for staying the whole time appreciate it Love you guys. Six 